Hello and gents, Ro here, and welcome to Normal Films. Today we're going to continue our iMovie 10.1 tutorials, and in this tutorial we're going to cover titles, but in specifically we're going to focus on a specific title, which is uh, the Far Far Away title, and the, I believe, the end credits title as well. So let's go ahead and jump right in. I'm actually going to be covering an issue that is actually going on. I believe it's a glitch. And, but there is a way to work around it, but it is a long process. So with my iMovie open, I'm in my projects tabs. I'm going to go ahead and select my iMovie tutorials project, double click on it to open it up here. And uh, we're going to go straight into the titles, which is what we're going to be covering again in this tutorial. Let's scroll all the way down to the far, far away title. And uh, the main issue that we've been having is basically I'm slowing down the far far away title as you can see once we've uh, placed it here into our project it's automatically puts it at 10 seconds here and it already has some pre-filled text we're actually going to change the color to white and uh, the everything else we can keep the same but now if you notice I'm gonna go ahead and play this 10 second you'll notice the text actually goes very very fast which makes it very difficult to read as shown here now expanding the text, as you can see, should normally slow down the text. For example, here it is 50 seconds. It would normally slow down the text, but instead it still consistently goes fast and makes it difficult to read. And uh, I believe this is personally a glitch because um, it, as you can see, the text already goes away by like, I'd say maybe 20 seconds and you have all this extra space for your text. Normally when you expand it like this, it's supposed to slow down, which is what makes this to be a glitch in the actual system. I'm hoping iMovie will be able to fix this soon. I'll be personally sending a report of this to uh, Apple myself regarding this application. But uh, now if we look at the, let's go to the um, scrolling credits option, which looks very similar, but it's in a flat plane. I'm gonna put that in as 10 seconds here. And uh, let's go ahead and play that. And as you notice, it goes for the entire 10 seconds. Just like this, as it goes for the entire 10 seconds. Now, if we make it shorter, it will go a lot faster just to fit that 10 seconds. And then if we expand it, it goes for that 10 seconds, making it, I mean, for that 46 seconds, making it go even slower. And this is exactly what we want the far, far away title to be doing but it's not so there's again the proven of the glitch issue so we're gonna go ahead and put the far far away text in here as well the workaround for this would be to simply make the text uh, let's say you make it 10 seconds you put in all the text that you want in it you want to first make sure that it first scrolls all through the text just like the way you want it here and the best way to do this is to put it in its own project so you would remove any previous items in your project and then export that simply just export that as the text now you would just export this file straight to your desktop and then you can import it back into iMovie and then from there you'll be able to slow it down by expanding it and you'll notice that it, it will actually take longer it did, but that's a huge workaround um, it's honestly it's a pain and you shouldn't have to do that so the best way is either basically wait for a patch or do the long way workaround. Um, I just thought I'd make a quick video regarding this. Also, if you really need it to be sideways or if you could use the end um, scrolling text, then uh, you, this could also be a workaround for you could use the scrolling credits as well. But uh, that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching and be sure to leave any questions and comments in the comment section below. Thank you and later. So let my life be